Hey guys, I hope everybody is doing well. Um, I've been uh, good. I've been trying this week to not put a lot of um, time, I guess, out of work, but I'm more in, in school and uh, in family because I don't know if I feel sometimes that I, I just need it. And the good thing about my job is that in some, some way they kind of like um, give me the opportunity to uh, dedicate a lot of time to my school in my classes so yeah that's that's the new thing about this week i guess um and of course midterms which <laughs> it's going i guess um i hope i and i wish everybody could look with that um i am talking this uh, this uh specific week about john corleano corleano his family is uh, originally from italy but he was born in uh, new york city he actually graduated from the school uh from school from the university in in um in new york and um um i really liked talking like um researching about him and his life because especially more than anything because of his awards um me and my family we have this tradition of every year watching uh the oscars and um i noticed when i was looking at his um life that he won uh the academy award by, in 1999 by with um a song called the Red Violin. This was also this is a movie, but um, he played one song for this this uh, movie, and uh, he won the Academy Award. And uh, I don't know, it's very I, to me, it's very like refreshing to watch these kind of things because I I love it, you know, and um, uh, like investigating and and um, linking. Uh, my my classes with this uh, like particular hobby that I have it's is really it's really refreshing and um, in the video when he receives the Oscar he is saying that uh, he's talking about the way he like the industry has treated him and uh, that whenever you compose like a, a, a song it's not really um, not like appreciated but it's more like a personal thing to do like you do it for yourself and then yeah of course you present it and everything but it's more like a, like a like a refreshing thing for yourself than when you do it um, like and, and you share your music with a movie and with a whole industry like a whole complete different industry which is the movie industry the film industry and uh, that when he did this um his life kind of like changed because of the way people started to like to look at him and his music and i don't know i feel like i really like this about him and um i was also listening let me put it to symphony number no. one which was one of his uh, best works is one of his best works and when it uh, started, I really liked it because it's. I, I feel like there's a lot of tension in, in the song. And um, there's a lot of highs and lows. And uh, I really like that. I, I feel like it's different than what we have heard before with other, with other composers. And um, I don't know, I really enjoy uh, watching him, I um, I would like to talk more about him, but time is coming to an end. <laughs> and uh, but yeah, I, I think he was he's very he's it's very interesting, and I, I am for sure gonna keep listening to his music and and what he has created. And uh, yeah, I really hope uh, everybody had a good 